Right guys, as some of you may already know, recently we have been to Lincoln to visit the police station and the prison, as you can see in Marty's video, Marty Blackborough, and uh, we got a bit of a surprise when the police tried to issue us with fines, well they did, did issue us with fines, and uh, it seems to have made quite a media stir. We're uh, on the BBC's website, uh, many other Lincolnshire Live, Leeds Live, and uh, we've been on the radio. I've had seven people been in touch with me, said they've been driving home from work, and our story's been on the radio, and they were like gobsmacked. They were like, oh my God, is that Matt 12128? And yeah, apparently it is. I got a bit of a shock when I got in from work, and I had a message off Marty, and some links to the um, news articles. I was like, whoa. <laughs> so yeah, guys, we're famous. We've got some publicity there. Uh, there's some links to the different stories in the description. If you have a look down there, you can read them all yourself. So yeah, can't believe it actually made it onto the BBC though. That's the that's one that got me. I was dead proud. I sent one over to Facebook on me, to my dad and I said, hey, look, I'm famous. And he was, he was like, oh yeah, I'm so proud of you, mate. And, I've got a feeling there's a bit of sarcasm in that one, but nevertheless, any publicity is good publicity. So, um, well, what we're going to do is, uh, we've been issued fines, so we're going to wait for them to come through, and we're going to contest them immediately, because, like I say, we're both self-employed, I've got self-employment records, I'm down as a YouTube vlogger, so there's no way it's going to go to court and they'll say, oh, well, you know, you weren't working, etc, etc. I can prove it. That's that's the income that I get from it is doing them videos. And that's exactly what I was doing. So we're going to get that overturned at court. And then what we're going to do is we're going to head back over there and we're going to do another audit at the police station at Lincoln and just sort of like ask them a few questions as to what they think about us uh, getting our fines overturned and just basically have a bloody good laugh at their expense just to let them know that we've sort of got away with it. We'll also get in touch with the people that were reporting on the initial incident, um, the BBC, Lynx Live, all the others, and we'll say, look, where are them people that you reported on X amount of time ago? and uh, we've actually been to court with those fines and they got overturned so would you like to do a little story on that just to inform everyone that the police were in the wrong and we were in the right we were innocent all along and uh, yeah just let everyone know that was hoping we would get fined that it didn't happen I'm like massively confident that it won't happen so and in fact I'm off to do another one this Saturday and doing a couple of police stations then so if they want to try and go down that route with the fines then that will be fine because like i say it will just get chucked out so anyway i'll leave you with that and uh, watch this space we'll let you know what happens when them fines do get overturned and we'll also have a juicy video for you of when we return to lincoln and uh yeah have a laugh at their expense i will post my lincoln videos in the next month or so i'm gonna let marty settle down you can see some of his over on his channel mine are good they're quite different i've got some different footage and some different interactions i tried to split away and go and talk to some of the police or give them a hard time the ones that marty wasn't talking to so there's some good different interactions going on in them videos and uh, like i say i'll post them in a few weeks time right i'll be back at the weekend with an audit catch you later guys Take care. Good night.